What's up guys? This is Jay from Jay Walker POV welcoming you guys back to another week coming to you with episode 2 of live from last week. Let's go. 3, 2, 1, go. Welcome back guys. Today is Tuesday, December 29th. Last week's episode, if you missed it, would be up there. So click it if you want to check that out. Gonna try to surprise a fiance by cleaning the bathroom before she wakes up. I got my cleaning hat on. Let's see how it goes. So yesterday, the fiance was very appreciative of how I cleaned the bathroom. Was gonna make a reaction video, but she didn't want to be on camera. So tune into future episodes to see when she will allow us to get a glimpse of her. As a token of her appreciation for me cleaning the bathroom, I got some pancakes. With it being December 30th, just want to wish happy birthday greetings to Jeremy from Wysik. Happy birthday, buddy. Hope everything's doing well with you. Also, happy birthday, Carla. Hopefully, we'll get to fly the skies with you sometime soon after this pandemic's over. Also, happy birthday, Morgan, who's friends with one of my family friends, JJ Pasco. Michigan! Happy birthday to them three. Uh, hope you guys are doing well and you guys stay safe out there. Before I go to night shift tonight, just want to let you know it's time for the lesson of the week. Usually, every December 31st, I make a uh, top 10 New Year's resolutions slash goals for the upcoming year. And I'm about to post them on Facebook right about now. Check it out. And post. I post them to Facebook so that I have something to look back to whenever I forget that I have New Year's resolutions. And to track my progress to see how well I'm doing with accomplishing those goals. It also keeps me honest and on track of what I want to do and where I want to be. Hoping for the best for the new year. Just want to do a couple birthday shout outs for December 31st. Aaron Ramos, FKR. Happy birthday, buddy. Hope you and Angie and the family are doing well. Also, wanted to shout out to Abigail. Happy birthday, asthma buddy. Hope you're doing all right during this time. Want to wish you guys happy birthday once again. It's also nice to see how the different places in the world celebrate New Year's and especially in a time like this during the pandemic. It'll be interesting how they actually go about doing New Year's celebrations this year.
one, happy new year. Welcome to 2021, fellow jaywalkers. Just wanna do a quick birthday shout out to the world. Happy birthday world, happy new year. Goodbye 2020. And after only a couple of hours of sleep, gotta go back to the grind. Gotta get back to editing those videos. Those videos won't edit themselves. Gotta get off to a good start by working on that New Year's resolutions list. Gotta start doing those 100 push-ups every day. Here we go. And after several hours of editing on a new 60 second video series called Jaywalker POV in 60, I finally got my video from New Year's up on YouTube. I'll leave the link above, but definitely go check it out. New day, new you. Welcome to January 2. Happy birthday greetings to Jared. Happy birthday, Jared. I got a packet of blueberries as a gift. And got a big blueberry here for you. Happy birthday, Jared. After doing those 100 push-ups for the first time in a long time, my chest is sore, but that doesn't mean you can't do house chores. It feels like a scrub laundry kind of day. Man, this 100 push-up a day challenge has been very, very, very difficult. Uh, I forgot that if you don't do exercises after a while, you get a lot of soreness in the areas that you haven't exercised a lot before. Last night, I could only do modified push-ups and probably like 10 at a time, just because there's so much soreness and my range of motion from the exercises was very, very limited. But the good thing is I was still able to get the 100 in just one at a time and it's all about the progress not necessarily doing everything at once but always look on the positive note you will get better over time this morning only able to do 60 push-ups so i still got 40 more to go let's go just gonna do a couple birthday shout outs for january 3rd Happy birthday, Ia. Hope you, Kaylin, and the family are doing all right at this time. We got Marvin from Winnipeg going back to Toronto. Happy birthday, buddy. Hope that we can play some tennis or hang out or play some badminton next time you come back in town. Happy birthday to my old CA buddy, Matthew Douglas. I see you with that camera. Keep up the good work. Keep up those nature photos coming. Happy birthday to Carly, who I've known since I was younger through dance. I see you too, teaching and influencing the young generation dancers that are coming up. Happy birthday to you all, and y'all have a good one. Just arriving to the TTC subway station after a 20 minute walk, out of breath, because 20 minutes ago, this is what happened. Just gonna go on a little rant. The TTC bus here doesn't come for another 35 minutes because I guess it's a Sunday schedule, ran the stoplight, and now I'm stranded for another 35 minutes before I go for my first of four night shifts. So, kinda sucks, but guess I gotta wait. Second part of the rant is the bus fully past the bus stop, only to cross the intersection, stop at the intersection, drop somebody off where there's no bus stop, and then continue on its way. So now I still have to wait for another bus, for another half an hour before going to work. The perks of taking the TTC guys, that's what it is. Good afternoon fellow jaywalkers. Just woke up from a couple hour nap after doing my first night shift of four night shifts. Just want to apologize for my rant last night. Uh, it's just that the TTC could be so frustrating sometimes with how often the buses come, how often the trains come, uh, with two buses coming at the same time. I know that some of you commuters can really empathize with how I was feeling last night. But on a good note, the countdown is on. 10 more months till it's the birthday for this guy. Anyways, I want to thank you for watching up until this point. Be sure to like the video, share the link, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And to wrap up, some word of advice. You guys stay safe out there, stay healthy out there, 
and we'll see you next time on Live From Last Week.